What's up, what's up, what's up, family? This is Hair Model for you, and thank you for tuning into my channel, as I am. Today, I'm going to bring to you the sensational 360 style. Now, this is a human hair blend, and it comes in four pieces. It comes with a 12-inch, a 14-inch, um, the nape piece, and also the closure piece. Okay, and what I did today, and this is actually... Um, the twist, I believe this is. This is the twist body in a color 1B. Okay, what I did is I sewed it on to a wig cap. And you guys all know which kind of wig caps that I use. So I actually sewed this onto a wig cap. So let me get right into it. Um, I've been wearing this for about three days. And to give you guys a real review. Because, you know, I, I, kinda, I hate giving reviews when you just put it on your head and just, you know, just give it the first review and never come back. I know. I've done some of those. So, um, let me tell you guys. I had to walk around with a brush like this. Okay? Because although the curl is really nice and it stays, I had to continuously do this throughout the day. I, m I must have went to the bathroom. Yesterday was worse. But today, I think I went to the bathroom about four times. Because I was walking, I felt it like kind of like crawling up on my neck a little. See? And I had to do like that. Okay? And this is a wig. Imagine if it was a sewing. Oh, man, I would be yanking on my braids trying to brush it out. And then I felt as if, you know, I had to leave it, you know, right here. So it won't, won't get all crazy in the back when I'm walking and look like a rat's nest on the back of my neck. So that's one thing that I... I, I wasn't happy with. Um, once you, of course, once you comb it through, you know, you have minimal tang tangling. But you remember, guys, I just brushed it. So obviously, if I brush it, you know, and then run my fingers through it, I'm going to have minimal tangling. But let you see me in the middle of the day and I try to go like this, I'll have some tangling. So that's one of the um, cons that I didn't like about this. Another con is that the actual weft is really, really thin and it's almost see-through. And if you want to use this hair as a sew-in, you would need two bags to actually complete your sewing. But if you want to use it as a quick weave, um, invisible part, it's actually a pro. Okay, so it's on my pro and my con side. Um, as for the weft construction and the actual weft, the beards look longer than the hair. Sorry to say that, guys, but the beards look longer than the hair. Um, so weft construction, I'm giving them like a five because, like I said, it's on the pro and the con side. Now, I'm only going to do the cons. I'll, do, I'll, I'll bring it back in the pros in a moment. So, um, another thing about, another con about this hair, um, I felt that it was kind of sort of mimicking, like, Barbie doll hair. This is a human hair blend, so you are able to curl it on low heat, but to me, it came off a little bit really fake, like, like a Barbie doll blend. Not a human hair blend, a Barbie doll blend with a couple of human hairs stuck in between the wefts. That's what I got out of it. Um, and those are my cons on this hair. Once again, this is Sensational 360 style, four piece, all in one kit. And here are my pros. My pros are I got caught in the rain today. And that's why the bang is a little bit stuck to my face because I got caught in the rain. But hold a curl. I told you, I've had this on for three days. It's a wig, so I take it on and off at night. So I can't really tell you when I go to sleep, does it mad up? I can't tell you that. I take it off. So I can't give you that part of the review. But I got caught in the rainstorm. It wasn't sprinkling, ladies. It was raining. Rainstorm. And the only thing that happened was this plaster to my head. But guess what? I said like this. I took it and whirled it around my finger, took this like this, start from the bottom, work your way up, and that's how you should always do with even your real hair, and twist it, booyah, curl is back, love it, love the curl, 
that's a big pro now another pro that I said is also a pro and a con is that this hair the weft is thin so you don't have to split your weft when you do your invisible part so this hair is perfect for layering over each other because it's so thin that it will give you a flat appearance for a quick weave perfect for a quick weave another pro is it's affordable so if you're on a budget and you need something to last for about two weeks here it is. This is it. If you're on a budget, this is what you need to deal with. Okay? And so, guys, I hope I answered all the questions. I gave you guys the pros and the cons on this hair. You guys, you know, are going to formulate your own opinion. I'm only here to share what I know and what I experienced with this hair. And like I said, you know, if you're on a budget, if you're doing a quick weave, if you like very thin webs and you want to lay them on top of each other, if you like hair that automatically curls, if you like a silkier texture, this hair is for you. If you're more of a yakky type of person, a kinky straight type of a person, um, like thick webs, more of a sewing type of girl, um, this might not be the hair for you. Matter of fact, I am gonna I am gonna claim it and say this not this is not the hair for you. Okay, so my name is Hair Model, and thank you for watching this review, and stay tuned for more. I love you guys so, so, so much. 360 style sensational. Get it if you like this review, y'all. Bye-bye.